Bruce, we got any updates? No. I mean, uh, Gene had the, just a couple of them, and ain't going to work. So we're back in her court after he finished up all his analysis on the smaller structures. Out. Pretty much we got that done now, all, exactly. all the culverts. So. Yeah. Uh, he was revising it today a little bit when I talked to him. Uh, and then Bob shot another bridge down on that last haul route that they sent. Um, <coughs> so as of right now, no, we do not have a defined haul route. <coughs> Well, Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys ain't meeting next week, are you? No. You look better. You I'm feel better? better. Uh -huh. I'm doing better. Uh -huh. So. Surprised an old guy can heal up that quick. Yeah, right? well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, old people usually don't feel up that quick. Fine age. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't know if James called in this morning, you know. I have no idea what James is. But I, I don't know if there's anything to talk, talk about. You. Really, I mean, we I really look for him to be here, but if, if uh, like he said, if he ain't got to find all route, there ain't no reason for him to be here. You know, that's... Bruce, do you know the location of the bridge that probably failed? No. I, I did print that all. Okay. Kind of all showed up late Friday. You didn't see it. I guess you didn't get a copy. Of it. I haven't yet, but go back and look at emails Friday. We did get some. Okay. <clears throat> is the is the parallel? Do you say they're using it now? Maybe. Well, they're showing that. Well, they tried to pass them off as a transmission haul line, but hell, guys, you know as well as I do, they're going to run bigger loads down it. Yeah. I mean, it's. I thought day one that would be the major haul route, just so you could come down 75 versus all the. Well, that, what I said, you know, to where, to where the majority of their stuff's going to go, that ain't a bad. You know. Well, I don't know why they didn't look at it before, but that popped up at the last minute. That was that was the last of the heavy haul routes that we've seen. And maybe it's because it's a busier road. I don't know. It would. Great minds think in different ways. Yeah. You know. I don't know why. Yeah. So we'll see you on the 30th? Yeah. Yes. All right. How did you guys' meeting go this week? Pretty good? Fine. Good. I mean, it's just, like you said, so we nailed down. Yeah. Thank you, Bruce. They got to get their mind made. I know it. Okay. And then move. Then then you can, you know, then you can count. Merry Christmas. You see you later. Let's see. I talked to Brown County Commission, and they pushed them pretty hard on this. Uh, and I don't know if Gary heard anything from Ku, that girl, you know. Right. But he pushed pretty hard, and they're they're coming out, and they're really more or less telling him that. They're telling Brown County that, listen, we don't do comprehensive plans. You know. The girl from KU? Yeah. Really? And she pretty well told us we, she did, you know, at the at the meeting. But hmm. now she's kind of telling us that, have you heard anything? I have not heard anything. But anyway, he said they push. he kept pushing the issue, pushing the issue. And finally he got a hold of a gal and she said, well, she says I've never done one. Oh, well. You know, so... Hmm. And I still haven't heard back from my guy, Gary. Yeah. But, uh, hmm. so he wanted some names, and I thought, well, I could give him a name of that guy that Corning and, and all the towns are using. Mm -hmm. But I thought I'd talk to you guys first. Good, thank you. You know, to see what you say. Of, uh, all that more whatever his name is, Mullen. The planner. Uh, yeah. The planner. Keith Marvin. Yeah. But I'd mentioned it to him a little bit there uh, that last planning meeting that Corning had. And his only concern was if um, depending on how the county wanted to proceed with planning 
he didn't want to be in the middle of something if anything was going to be that's uh, what my feeling superseding any of the stuff that he was doing within the towns from, that was my feeling I didn't think it <clears throat> you might have a little we'd have to have a conversation with him then right. and see how that balance was because he said depending on how the county proceeds with uh, zoning and stuff if it's something that's going to negate everything that he's been working for he he felt that within himself there was kind of an ethics deal there as far as um, you know having the um, the money and the input and everything just to be negated by something from the county then he didn't want to have something like that happen so. Well, it's not an easy <clears throat> situation, but everybody wants to move forward in a hurry, but but you really, I think, need to, you know, We haven't heard, heard anything from James. I'm assuming he's not calling in because he don't. We have any news anyway on the finalizer. Bruce here. Yes. Yeah. And no. He didn't really have any. Not nothing any really. No the, news they, on the hall route. Well, they have checked all the culverts now. One more bridge failed somewhere. Um, hey, buddy, this is <coughs> okay. So uh, the next need to come in today. Until we get it finalized. All right. Thanks. Hall Bye. route. Yeah. Now they know pretty much, but there's just some areas they're trying to dodge some of those bridges. You know, well, they got to go a mile or two out of their way to go around them. And then all of a sudden you run into a culvert yeah. or you run into something else. More work. I'm not sneaking up on anybody. You right? heard anything from James? We haven't either, so probably not anything. I've heard nothing. No, I don't. Okay. Nothing's probably going to happen today. I haven't heard anything about a road haul, about a road use. No, nope, we haven't got any final. Yeah. Okay, so.